speak in English. So now, as I introduce our first speaker, please listen carefully. Well, she is a graduate of Communication Arts in Miriam College, Quezon City. She is also a learning counselor and a trainer. She is also a language assessor, certified in all skills, which are listening, speaking, writing, writing, and reading. So let me welcome, let us give a round of applause to Ma'am Rachel P. Bahada.
Now, we try or we can do all kinds of things without prejudice. So no matter what nationality you come from, whether you're from Korea, Japan, India, Africa, well, Africa, Africa, maybe if they have student immigration, all right? So we are here to give you the service that you need. Now, what is our mission and vision? Now, we're going to see advocates change. What does that mean? Unless you are open to change, then there can be no growth for growth and development. All right? This means that you won't get anywhere if you're so close-minded and you don't want to accept change. Nowadays, there are a lot of changes going on, especially in Metro Manila. All right? Now, uh, we believe that learning is not what? A privilege. It is an obligation to oneself. This means then that if you have an opportunity to learn, learn as much as you can. Alright? And we encourage people to take responsibility for their growth and build relationships because it opens opportunities and expands one's vision and perspective. Now, our mission, our mission is actually to initiate positive transition in the lives of those we serve, to reach out to societies lacking in awareness, and encouraging them to take responsibility for the education of their youth, to encourage the blessed to share their blessings with others. So you are actually blessed to have reverence soon. You know that? Do you agree? Yes. Okay. At the same time, you are given the opportunity to learn, to have an education that you need, which most people don't have that privilege. And to pursue all efforts to banish social withdrawal on account of insecurity, social culture, stature, disability, educational attainment, and economic background. Okay? And we take our commitment seriously and deliver to the satisfaction of every, uh, actually, people we meet or we service. Now, our vision, our vision is actually to see a nation devoid of ignorance and lack of opportunity to witness a population where people begin to take responsibility for their own mental, emotional, physical, and social growth. I don't want you to memorize all this because later on I can give you out some information about us. We have been doing to building a culture of responsible people willing to spend the time, the fortune, and knowledge in the support of those in need of transformation. All right, what is our uh, team profile? Okay, as you can see, we are graduates of international and local universities. Um, you know, we've innovated corporate and academic experts who have extensive working experiences in their own field of expertise. Now, what does this mean? Okay. I have, or I'm privileged to have taught uh, communication in terms of both academic and also in the corporate world. Right? I do training for companies in terms of enhancing their communication skills for students. I, we enhance communication skills for those who need to hold their conversational skills, their what? Uh, English, English, meaning to say for those students who need to further enhance their skills, like non native English speakers seeing that English as a second language. Right? Now, uh, we are also TESOL, uh, we hold TESOL certificates, meaning to say our certificates are also accredited by the Department of Foreign Affairs. All right? And to give you an idea of who we are, this is uh, Ms. Geraldine Thompson of the CS, who's our director, who's in charge of the company. And then the team of trainers consists of, of course, me, Ms. Rachel, all right? And we have also other trainers like Ms. Rebecca Basilio, all right? 